The government plans to audit the information and communication skills of all civil servants to map out ICT gaps in the sector. ICT Cabinet Secretary Joe Mshero says the move will help to improve digital capacities as part of Kenya's digital transformation agenda. ICT illiteracy remains high in the public service, hampering the rollout of e-government services to the public. ICT sector has grown by an average of 10.8% annually since 2016, according to the World Bank. The sector now accounts for about 8% of Kenya's GDP. According to Business Monitor International, Kenya's information technology market was valued at 64 billion shillings at the end of 2020, with computer hardware sales totaling 37 billion, while IT software sales were valued at 18 billion, and the balance on other services. The Digital Economy Blueprint launched in 2019, seeks to deepen the use of ICT services in the public sector and increase investments in the industry. Just as uh, we are seeing here, civil servants getting their skills, being up, up, updated, then everybody in the country must do the same so that then they are part of this ecosystem. They are part of being able to improve whether it's uh, the business they are in or uh, whether it's entertainment, whatever they are doing, so that then it is better for the country. The government says that upskilling its workforce is part of the plan to ensure Kenya grows its digital economy. Technology moves very fast. New things come up all the time. And especially in the civil service, if you do not train, then uh, we may end up being overtaken uh, by events. Speaking during the graduation ceremony of 375 civil servants drawn from the public sector, county government and parastatals, ICT Cabinet Secretary Joe Mosheru says there is a need for technical training aimed at improving the IT knowledge in the public sector. Can we have an audit that says these are all the civil servants and these are all the ICT skills that they have? And then we say, how can we improve? Over the last two years, there has been tremendous growth in the use of ICT consequently, causing a ripple effect in the digitalization of efforts not only in government, but also within the private sector. However, Kenya's growing ICT sector still faces the daunting task of safeguarding against vices such as cybersecurity and information security, which the government says it is addressing. How do we ensure that we have the right security in place? How do we ensure that as a country we are moving and growing, but we're not using this same technology to create the problems sometimes we see on social media, where people misuse the services? You should be able to identify them and in some cases deal with them, or where people are being either harassed. All these things need to be taken into account. Kenya, through the ICT authority in conjunction with Huawei Kenya, has been upskilling civil servants through technical and non-technical courses to over 1,500 public servants since 2020.